Hi, I'm Jen Hadfield from Tater Tots and Jello, and I'm also a designer with Pebbles and American Crafts. And I'm so excited to be here at scrapbook.com to share my newest collection. It's called Chasing Adventures. And I recently got remarried about a year and a half ago. And so my husband has a daughter and then I have four kids. So we've been blending our family and it's been really fun. So one of the ways that we love to get our kids together is going on trips and creating memories. And so this line is based on that. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to make this travel journal. So when we go on our trips, sometimes it's hard to bring all of our scrapbooking things. And I like to record all of the things that we've been doing while we're, on, while we're gone. So this is a journal that you can take with you and just add all of your comments and your pictures. You can bring like a little Instax camera, add your pictures or add them later when you get home. So I'm gonna show you how to make this journal. So this is made just out of paper and you can make it actually any size you want. I'm just gonna show you how I did it. You'll take your scrapbook paper and you can cut it down to whatever size you want. So I have a couple different sizes that I've made here. This one is eight inches high by six inches wide. And what you do to make the outside kind of sturdy is you connect two pieces of paper for the cover and that makes it so that it holds up really well. So what I did with this, I made two different sizes, but uh, I'm just gonna show you how to make this larger size. So I take my scrap of paper and I just fold it in half. So this is eight inches by six inches. And then, so I have two pieces of paper. We're gonna add the two pieces of paper together. And I think I want this to be my cover. So this is the same paper that I used on this album. So then all you're gonna do is just attach the two pieces of paper together. Then you're gonna just put this on top of this, like this. So you've added your two pieces of paper and added the adhesive behind it. And on this album, I put a hole punch through the back with an elastic. And that way, when you're on your trip, you can just shut everything and all of your little pieces stay inside. So now you're going to add the inside pages, which are just a tiny bit smaller than the cover. So you can kind of see on this one what I've done. Um, you can just take notebook paper or scrapbook paper. So on this, the first page here, I just put another piece of scrapbook paper inside just to add a little bit of cuteness to it. So this is just a little thicker that's from my line. It's, um, I have different sayings. This one says adventure, but there's all kinds of different sayings that are really cute. Explore, road trip, beautiful. And then Here's one of the little girls. And then all I've done is, while we were on our trip, just snap some shots with my Instax camera. And that leaves room for you to be able to add all of your notes and all of your memories while they're still fresh in your mind. Then in this, the center, same thing. And there's really cute washi tape in this line. So you can kind of see some of the washi tape that I added. And you can just make it with anything that you want, just personalize it to your taste. And then in the back, I added just a couple little envelopes so that you can tuck, you know, different like tickets and things like that inside. So this is just a really fun way to record your adventures while you're on your trip. And I hope you enjoyed it. And please check out all of the things that you can make with my new line, Chasing Adventures at scrapbook.com. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and want to see more from scrapbook.com, please like, share, subscribe, and leave a message. Happiness is life handmade.